I had made this stock analyzing agent by using this workflow only so all you have to do is ask for the stock information like this and if I just send that and as you can see it started working so right now it is giving all the informations that I really need so as you can see it's very first and only have to just wait kind of like some seconds and it will be in here so as you can see it has given all the informations for stock for Microsoft for two weeks so let me show you what it actually has given us Microsoft Corporation it actually that's the closest price and also you can see the MACD graph in here which actually shows that which is uptrend or downtrend kind of these things and also you can see the candles in here which is the green candle the red candle the green candle actually shows this it's actually growing up kind of this thing so also just giving a stock analyzing informations as you can see that MSFT stock summary it says that exchange these things in our world currency the open price high price the low price close price the volume and at the last after analyzing the graph and also this information it's actually giving me important data so as you can see it says that the stock experienced a positive day closing higher than its opening price after fluctuating between its daily high and low this upward movement was accompanied by a significant trading volume of over 22 million shares and blah 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 so if you are like a stock investor you know that this analyzing agent will be a game changer for you so watch this video until the end after watching this video I hope that and also I believe that you can make this same analyzing agent by yourself and if you're a service provider you can actually make that and also sell that to your clients and the first you have to come to NATN if you don't know about NATN that's an AI agent billing platform you can actually build AI agents AI automations without any kind of coding knowledge so if you didn't sign up yet go and sign up for NATN and you can actually just come in here this dashboard and then go with create workflow and that's actually the billing section you can actually just go and add things in here manually and add the stuffs but in this case I had made already the template you can actually find it on the description go to the link and after getting the template you actually see these things like this go and download the template the first and after downloading the template go to edit and again and go with the three dots and go with import from file and choose the downloaded template actually you downloaded that just go with that and open that and you can actually see these things so when you actually zoom that you can actually see that there are some red marks it actually identified that these things I didn't set up our first task is we have to set up these notes so we have to set up at the first the telegram I'll just get that and in here you can see that like that's saying a red mark that we have to just set the credential so go and go with create new credential so right now we have to give the access token to add our telegram to this NTN. so to do that it's very simple go to your telegram account and in here just go in the search bar and search here bot further and you can see these things go at the first which is actually the blue tick and you can see this thing and go with start to create the bot and here you can see you can create actually a bunch of stuff so in our case we actually want to create a new bot which is the first new bot create new bot I'll just go with that as you can see it says all right a new bot how you gonna call it so you have to just give a name I just go with stock analyzer that's it I just go with that it's saying now you have to give a username and the username have to be like this name and then slash bot so we have to just go with stock and attend one two six six giving number so it's like it is unique then i just go with bot remember that if the name is not unique it will say that like the name is not valid invalid go with another one so you have to choose a bot name that's very unique and all the letters are in small letters and also the last thing is you have to just add slash bot and then it says that done congratulations on your new bot and it says you can find it in here so if you just go and click this link you can actually see that that's our bot release so when you just click start it will be activated so right now our bot is activated also you can just go with that and you can add stuff like images profile images username kind of these things 
okay so right now we need the access token cost as you can see we need the access token so you can see that like use this token to access the http api so just go and click that as you can see it's copied come here again and paste that so right now go with save as you can see credential successfully created it's mean it's added successfully okay the first task is done go here again okay we had successfully added telegram our next task is we have to set the google gemini chat model you you can ask that like why i'm using google gemini chat model instead of using openai or anthropic so just to decrease the cost i'm using gemini chat model because i'm using that for free and let me show you that i'm using that just go with that and you have to just set the credential and go with create new credential in this case you have to give the api key just go here and go here google ai studio and after coming to google ai studio go with that and as you can see that at the in this dashboard at the top it says get api key go with that and in here you can see that there are like bunch of projects in my case but in your case there will be no project so if there's no project go and build the project at the first go to google cloud console so just go with that google cloud platform and after coming here just you can see that like these things and at the upside you can see that like there's actually project option go with that and go with create project just give a name kind of like you can just give any name you want just go with create that's it and in this case i created already projects so i just go with create api key and choose the project that in this case i'm going with test2 just go with create api key that's it as you can see that's api key has been generated successfully just go with copy and come here again and give the api key paste and then go with save as you can see the croatia successfully created go with cross so let's go with the next step so as you can see it like i actually just named it as 12 data if i just zoom that we have to go to 12 data and register that uh because we're actually using the 12 data api to get the stock data so when the user actually just you know saying that stock data for microsoft for two weeks or whatever it actually using 12 data to get the all of the knowledges or all of the data so that's why to get the api key of the 12 data we need to register the first so let me show you that why why we actually just you know uploading the 12 data before that also i'm showing you that why actually need the 12 data api if i just click that if i go here and you can see that i already set up everything it's saying like you are an api you are generator for stock analysis using 12 data api your goal is to generate complete you are based on user request and kind of this stuff also I just give a format that what you'd have to do also i just said uh like what have to be you know on the placeholders kind of this thing and in the key icon you have to give the 12 data api which is very simple go and cross with that just go here click this thing the orange icon 12 data register and you will just came here and you know in this case i already sign up you have to just sign up at the first give your email address or just go with the google that's it and go with here api keys and you can find your api key in here just go to reveal and just copy that thing came here again and just go with that 12 url generator and go to the go to the key icon again and in the down section of the key icon just give the 12 that api that's it and the next thing has been done successfully so let's just go to the next step which is this one google gemini chat that is showing in red icon because we have didn't select the credential when you just click that it will be just you know okay again just came here again as you can see it has been connected again just go with that again click that it has been connected just came here which is the chart image and let me just zoom a little bit so what you have to do is you have to go to chart image and you have to register that because in this case when you just you know click that you can actually find this thing x api and that's actually the value and in the xapi value you have to give the key so again just go and click in the orange thing and go with sign in in this case i already signed up so actually just going the basic plan which is like zero dollars per month go with the api key and you can actually just find your api key in here but before that you have to just go generate a key and it actually generated just go and grab that copy come here again just 
go to this chat image and just you know go in this section x api key and give the value that's it as you can see that has been also added again just came here it's actually showing the right icon and you just click that it will be okay like this and then again just click that okay so let me show you step by step what's happening in here at the first i'll just go and active this node only okay right, right now as you can see like it's activated so what i'll do i'll just came here so i have to just go to my ai agent at the first which is this one stock analyzer and then i'll just go with so i just go with stock for nvidia for one month so let me just send that as you can see it's gated the message so you can see that that's actually the message if you just go in the schema format you can actually find the message which is this one stock for nvidia for one month and then i use this node actually or this section and in here you can see it like there's the prompt actually and i had given this text message to here and i used this thing that i already showed you to get the url and let me show you what's the url is it's executing the node okay so that's the actually url actually i just get the url by using 12 letter and that's the url actually getting all the informations about the stock so then i just use the a normal http node and as you can see a normal http node and it's actually in gate format that's it then i just you know use the output in here and just get that in the url section then i just go with execute step so you can see all the informations if i show in the table format like the symbol nvidia interval one month currency usd kind of these stuffs and also you can see common stock you know the open low close daytime everything in here and then i used a chart image json so what's happening is based on the informations in here I, what i just got by using the 12 data uh, for like nvidia stock for one month i given this in here and in here to just show you that what i just really did i had given all the informations manually just giving the name then i just giving the information then i said that you are a json generator json actually code for chart image.com using trading view chat configuration then i said your task is to create json object that works with the chat image advanced trading view chart api that i give in a json format what it have to do like what you have to just you know uh, replace or kind of this thing and then i give an example that's how the json code have to be okay so right now if i just show you that how the json code is based on this json code the chart image actually create the chart so if i just show in the json you can see like there's a small uh, issue which is like json is just actually mentioning the json so to remove that we're actually using the json purifier so actually it's a uh, information executor kind of this thing and they are actually just you know i given the information which is the output of the ai agent or the chart image json then i use the name at json then i actually describe that uh, actually obviously it have to be a string then i just describe that what you have to do i said that transform the data into a valid json code and as you can see if i just go with execute step it will actually remove the json and it will just you know as you can see that it's actually in a perfect json code and that's i need really as you can see our json code has been purified but before that also we have to analyze the stock so in here we actually just you know let me show that what is happening i just said that you are stock analyzer and then i just given everything uh kind of like from here which is like 12 data okay so from here i just given everything again manually so what's gonna happen like this ai agent actually analyze all the data that it actually is gated from the 12 data also i said that like you have to give the informations after the analyzing in this format I actually give an example and at the last i said and lastly at two sentences analysis of the stock's performance today based on ohlc and volume and then if i show that what's happening here it actually analyzing the data of the 12 data and it's actually giving these informations you know kind of this thing okay then we actually you know using this chart image and we actually as you know that we actually just get the json code from the json purifier and we're actually just using this url in this case we're actually using post method and we are using the send headers uh, as you know that we actually just given the api key already 
and the rest of things are like on the type JSON application JSON then we actually giving a sand body and in here if I just show you that what's happening here in the JSON section I'm giving the JSON purify code that's the thing actually in here okay so let me just go and execute step so right now it will actually you know generate an image of the chart so if I just show in the view as you can see NVIDIA configuration one month uh, like there's a stops in here okay so then I'm sending the image and also the text the image I'm sending as like image sender you can see that like the chart ID I just you know find the chart ID if I just show in the schema go in the get message section and you can find the chat ID which is this one I just grab that and just you know put that in here then I open the binary file because the binary file is actually the image and then I just also send the text which is actually the analyzer so let me show you in the schema what's happening that I had given the stock analyzer this thing in the text and again I just use chat ID which is again in here which is like in the get messages you can find the chat ID that I already showed to send the image this one I just grab that I just put that again these things and at the last you have to just go with the add field in the text format just go with append and then attribution and make sure it's turn off so what's gonna happen like it will not add any kind of like anything uh, messages like this message has been sent by using anything kind of this thing okay so that's the thing actually so let me show you everything at at a glance what's happening in here so I just go and use that so I just go and execute workflow so as you can see right now it's listening which is this one waiting for your response kind of this thing okay so we actually just came here again I just copy that again and I'll just go with the same stuff so as you can see it's working on so it's just going with 12 stack data just it's very fast and it's actually generating the analyzing text okay so right now it's generating the image so I hope like I'll just get very first yeah as you can see like I just get it everything and as you can see all the informations the chart okay so you can see the everything you know the data which is like properly and video configuration one day okay fine then also I just go with kind of these things okay so you can see every information in the world currency like open price high price this kind of things I said the stock activated strong bullish performance kind of like today opening kind of these things uh, which is this information okay that's fine literally you know so what's gonna happen like I don't have to just come here again execute workflow so to do that I have to just go with activate that make sure you activate your workflow just going with that so what's gonna happen if you actually kind of like turn off that just turned off and you could just come here again you just go with another one stock so we have to just wait a little bit it's kind of like take one minute kind of this stuff and before that let me show you just what you have to do is uh, over the anatin it's not totally free it's like okay it's given so let me just go back then it's not totally free you will just get kind of like 14 days trial then you have to just go with upgrade which is kind of like 24 dollars per month kind of this thing and about the this thing which is actually the 12 data API it's you can actually use this kind of like eight times uh, every day so you can actually just get kind of like the stock informations eight times a day and also if I just talk about the chart image uh, chartimage.com which actually generate the images of the chart that thing actually just you can use that kind of like 50 times a day it's mean you can actually just get 50 images every day so basically if I just say you everything in a summary you can actually use that for 14 days then you have to go with kind of like the N10 pro plan you have to upgrade that if you have an upgrade version that's fine uh, you can actually use that completely for free that's the thing and as you can see like and everything is like very detailed as you can see that like it actually just in very live also you can actually use the agent you know to do more stuff kind of like taking actions just you know buying stocks kind of these things which will be super good though and that's all it is i hope like this video helped you make sure to give a like and subscribe to the channel for more videos inshallah you will find more values in the future that's it guys peace out